Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Lunar Jetman on the Sinclair ZX Spectrum. What else? And this is a game request by Paul C on YouTube. Right, when I said what else, I don't think this came out on any other system. Could be wrong. This was a supposed to be a classic on the Spectrum, the original 48K Spectrum. Um, came out by Ultimate Play the Game. I think this was a follow-up game from Jetpack, which was a good game. Right, I don't know the keys. I've had a, well, the keys are sort of weird. I've had a quick go with the keys, but I didn't really like the key layout, and I didn't really know all the keys. Um, so we're going to use Kempston. Well, not exactly a Kempston controller, but... This is emulated, of course, but a controller is a controller. Right, so we're going to put it on Kempstern and let's play the game. I've had a test run of it and I needed to. Um, so I think the premise of this game is to go out and blow a missile up or something. The controls, I don't know, they're not as good as Jetpack. Um... Because if you hold down, you you stay um, floating in that area, not, not that area, in that line. But I find, I've, as I said, I've had a few test runs, for fuck's sake. And I find this fucking difficult. It's a really difficult game. Look. Right, I need to pick the bomb up. Right, we've got the bomb. Now we need to load it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, now we need to load the bomb up onto our moon buggy thingy. Eh, hey, we've achieved it. Fucking, oh, bollocks! And I do believe this is the game why pokes were invented. Blimey, you need a poke. But we don't cheat on this channel. We play the game as it was intended to be. For a classic game, it's a bullseye one. Yeah, I, was, I could be wrong about that punk thing, by the way. Don't take that literally. But I wouldn't be surprised if it was this sort of game that invented the punks. <laughs> Why, I don't know, in a magazine you got a poke. Because the game is quite difficult to play. I mean, as I said, the controls are no way as good as the original um, jetpack. Now I need to... God, oh, come on. I need it to go down, but I can't make it go down. I have to wait, rely on the thing to do it itself. Oh, blimey. I need to get into the... Bloody, they're still coming. Right, get into the van. The van? Oh, come on. There's something I've got to push to drive it. See, they just come up. They just... Seriously, they just respawn. Right, now we, and we can't go nowhere because we need to fill in those fucking holes with a girder. It's supposed to be a moon buggy, but it can't fucking go over nothing. What a useless pile of shit. Right, now I need to... Here we go. Deploy the girders. I think you only get two. Ah, oh, fuck's sake, this is really difficult. Didn't have a chance! The fucking objects move faster than you do! I am finding this quite frustrating to play. Let's have another go. He moves so slow when he's on the ground. Also, there's a little bit of inertia in it, which you expect. I think there was in uh, Jetpack. But it just was much better. At least that was a really decent playable game. I mean... I mean, the graphics look good for 1983, don't get me wrong. But it just looks like they just ramped up the difficulty on this guy. Oh, I fucking dropped it! 
Now, ah, oh, for fuck's sake! Yeah, it's a frustrating game. Oh, Jesus. A push fire! They just move too they just move too quickly. It don't give you a chance. And I picked up the girdle. Where's my bomb? Oh, this is ridiculous. Seriously, did anyone struggle with this game back in the day? I thought this was regarded as a classic, but... I can understand in some ways, but if it was this, it's this difficult... I wouldn't know way I've enjoyed it. I wouldn't have enjoyed playing this. Ah, oh, fuck here now. Right, let's get the bomb, at least put it on the truck. Well, I've called it a truck, a van, or whatever. I just called it a useless piece of shit because it can't do nothing. Can't drive over nothing, can it? Can't really call it a moon buggy. I ain't gonna be out of it, I need the girders now, so. See, they're coming! Ugh. It's too frustrating, this game. It's relentless. Look, they just come. Right, I need to put the girder. Right. It's more like you can clear the area. You know, they just keep coming back. They just keep respawning and coming back. Oh, God. It's not like... I'm finding this really frustrating to play. I really am. This um, this jetpack started off quite easy and worked its way up for being harder. This just starts off quite difficult. Controls are better on um, jetpack. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake! I'm just finding this really frustrating, but that's just me at the end of the day. I can't get nowhere in this game. I just cannot get nowhere. You, I think this game was designed to be cheap. I think it's, it's got to be. I think it was designed to have pokes, this game. As I'm just finding it way too frustrating. It's just too difficult. I mean... It's no point just keep blasting everything. They're just going to keep going back. It's just going to keep coming back. No point. Right, pick up the bomb. Load it onto the truck. The useless fucking moon buggy that can't go over nothing. Now, let's get in and try and drive the fucking thing. Actually... <sighs> Fuck's sake! Get in the fuck! Oh, Jesus Christ! Even though I pushed the wrong fucking button, now I've got a fucking right. Put the fucking girder in the hole, and here comes something else to fucking blow us up and lay another hole. This is so frustrating. This game. Oh, what chance do I have there? I'm finding this too frustrating to play. I thought it would be quite a nice, easy game to play being regarded as a classic, but I'm finding it fucking frustrating. Right, one more go, and that's it. That'll be it, because I'm not enjoying this. Well, this is a game that I thought I should be enjoying, but I'm not. I mean, this is probably all you're going to see. Me just shooting a few fucking bits and pieces here and trying to load the bomb onto the truck. That's all you're going to fucking see. See, even... Oh, gee, this is annoying. This game is annoying to play, really. It, oh, I'm just finding it frustrating. It's just... 
It's frustrating. You just can't turn around too quickly because the objects move too fast. I can't. I'm. I am glad I didn't play this back in the day. I'm glad my mate didn't own that because I think we would have got pissed off playing it. Jetpack, on the other hand, was a much, much better game. Much more playable, much more enjoyable. This is fucking frustrating. I know the Spectrum people are going to say, yeah, but it was a classic, you're just, yeah, whatever. I don't give a fuck. I find it frustrating. I don't give, give a fuck what anybody says. I'm finding it frustrating. If you don't like it, tough. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and thank fuck for that. It's a pity, really, but it's too fucking difficult. Goodbye.